The FA Cup's always a difficult cup, you know, because it's it, it, there's a lot of giant killing it. There's a probably will be this weekend as well, and, and you always want to make sure it's not you. It's the one that, that is that. So we knew it'd be difficult for the first hour of the game. Maidstone came here with 1,500 fans. You know, probably one of the biggest away supports we've had here in the se this season. So they were up for it. They made it difficult. They got the first goal, which is always makes it extremely difficult in an FA Cup game. But the players showed great resilience. They were calm, composed. Eventually, got the first goal, and then once we got the second goal. You know, the, the, the game changed totally and we were in a lot of control. So I, I'm pleased to get through in the hat and then we move on. You know, the, the ball comes out, the boy smashes it. You know, it could hit anywhere. It could, there's a few other shots in the second half did, but, you know, and it rebounds off the keeper. And if it went half a yard to the left, Landell clears it. If it goes half a yard to the right, George Williams clears it. Unfortunately, it went straight to the player and he put it in. So... It's part of football, but we, we managed to resume our composure and get back in it. The biggest thing we spoke about was remaining calm. You know, from a coaching staff perspective, myself, we went and spoke calmly to them because we knew that the quality is there. It's an FA Cup game that I've played and been involved in so many games like this where, you know, the, the, the worry of being the one as a cup upset puts a bit of fear into everyone. You know, I think that the, the whole place was on an edge a little bit today because we've already been through Hyde, but we managed to come through it and then we get another game like this where it's extremely difficult and but we showed good resilience. The fans were great, stayed strong and eventually our quality came through. The guys before them did a lot of hard work, the yards to wear down the opposition and then the last 30 minutes the two of them come on and their pace causes real pro problems to Maidstone so I'm, I'm pleased for Cags because you know he's a, he's a great kid he went through a little period at the start of the season where he couldn't find the back of the neck but the last couple of weeks have been great for him hopefully that continues the, the main thing is to try and get a home draw that'd be great and then the two aspects of it are the first one is we, we get a lesser team hopefully get ourselves through our second option is that we've got a huge team and have a great day and put on a good performance. So we shall see what happens on Monday night. It was a proper FA Cup game. You know, they, they, the opposition come and they make it difficult and the fans, you know, there was a lot of excitement. We had some shots at goal, with some misses. They get the goal and the atmosphere changes a little bit. But, you know, coming out in the second half was great. They got behind us. We get the first goal, they push us to get the second and then at the end, you know, we did really well and thankfully, hopefully the fans enjoyed the day.